Time for a uh, chicken update, guys. Livestock update, whatever you want to call it. Uh, I've got new birds. These I've had for, these are Americunas. They're not the Aracuna, not to be confused with those. These are, uh, yeah, I, I think, it, uh, if I understand the uh, history of these things right, these were bred with the Aracuna, the true Aracuna from South America. The Aracuna doesn't have, it's a rumpless bird, and it doesn't even, from what I understand, it doesn't even have oil glands like uh, a normal chicken would in the rear. But uh, those are the, uh, they call them Easter Eggers, some people do. And those two, they're always doing this. They fight and fight and fight. I'm not sure if that's two roosters or not, but hens, hens do that too when they're, when they're younger, I've noticed. But those two are particularly uh, engaged, if you will. Uh, the barred rocks are getting bigger. Uh, that is, uh, we call this one Miss Lorena. But it turned out that Miss Lorena is uh, more like a Mr. Larry. But he's getting big. He's, he's way outgrown the, uh, his siblings there. And this is Gus. He's catching up. Not quite as big as Mr. Larry there. Uh, that's another Maracuna there. Um, and here is an adult Maracuna that I bought. That is, uh, that's, my wife calls her sissy. She's been a good egg layer. She's been a good egg layer. You can see the, uh, my gold comets. They're growing right up. And Solomon, the big boy over there, he's, he's crowing every day. And th these little guys here, I got two, um, two Welsomers chicks from a buddy of mine. He breeds chickens. He he turned me on to a couple of Welsomers. I got two of those. They're, they're supposed to lay a chocolate, a chocolate egg. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get on inside and show you around the coop. And those are our white leghorns. They're, we've got, I don't know where the other two are. We've got four of those. And that is, um, that's one of our white rocks. That's old speck there. Uh, there's another one of the leghorns. Now I think the leghorns are the ones that are kicking all the straw out of my nest boxes. They're, oh, there's our other Easter egger, Americuna, whatever you want to call. I call them Americunas. Uh, that's little D. And let's see here. Well, there's the other Welsomer chilling out there by herself. It's unusual for her to be doing that. Normally she's out hanging out with her, uh, her sibling there. You got uh, trying to keep my 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 chickens are are wanting to get up here and roost on the back of this thing on the back of the next boxes and they uh, and they're crapping down in here. I, I'm gonna have to redo this. Looks like we got three eggs here. I'll go ahead and get those. This is one of the eggs from the uh, Americunas. It's a I don't know if the camera's really doing the color justice. Let me kind of get some more light here. It, that's a like a, a pale green. I've seen these. Uh, Eggs speckled. I've seen them uh, a little more on the gray side, but uh, yeah, we got that was probably Sissy that did that. Uh, little D's not a, she's not as reliable with her laying at all, but they're doing good. It, it's getting time uh, where I think my my uh, my golden comets. I think they're going to start. Uh, or red comets, I can't remember. The, 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 the thing with these chickens, people have nicknames, slang names. Uh, I've heard these referred to as gold comets, red comets. They were, uh, I was thinking they were golden comets, but anyway, it doesn't matter. As long as they lay brown eggs here within uh, the next month or so. I think they're getting, I um, think they're getting close. I think they're getting close, but yeah, having the five Americunas, I... Uh, I'm enjoying those birds. They're very, they're they're beautiful. The the colors on them, you can see, and they they come in all different colors. These adults over here, I really enjoy these. I really enjoy these birds. Sissy, she's just the, 
you wouldn't think that chickens would have that much personality but she is very a very docile chicken and little d she's very aggressive or pretty different but uh these uh these little of uh, these two uh wellsomers kind of touching on that note of their personalities i've got the one in there that's uh, by herself she's more apt to just chill out and relax she'll even let you uh, walk up to her and pick her up not even uh you know she won't try to fly off or or get away from you or anything and this one it will they haven't been treated any different you know they're it's it's pretty inter pretty interesting thing the whole raising chickens so i'm gonna i'm gonna get these eggs on in the house get them in the fridge get them washed up and i'll catch you guys later